Hey everyone, Michelle here. I am going to do a, well, attempt to do like a holiday look today. And I'm going to use all drugstore makeup, nothing high end. Um, I'm even going to forgo like the Urban Decay Primer Potion. Just to prove that you can do a beautiful holiday look with like drugstore makeup instead of the higher end makeup. So I've already got my foundation and powder on and it is hot as a whore right here because of the stupid light. I definitely need to work on my lighting. But my foundation today I'm using the Maybelline Mineral Powder, Mineral Power um, foundation and it's in two for medium. And then for my powder I use the Hard Candy Mattifying Powder. Alright, so we're going to start off with a little base for my eyelid and I'm going to be using what am I using Maybelline's Dream Mousse Shadow and this is 16 in Black Spice and I have just a Essence of Beauty like synthetic bristle brush And I'm just going to put this on the lid part. Try to avoid the crease. And this part doesn't have to be perfect because we're just going to be going over it. Now that you got that on, I'm going to switch to, so I don't know what it's called, but it's this color right here, and you can get these at Sally Beauty for 99 cents a piece. I'm just going to take an e.l.f. eyeshadow brush, and we're just going to put this right on top of the black. Maybe. And it comes out this like dark, like bronzy, goldish color. And just clean it up a little bit. Alright, so this is what the gold looks like. Or the bronze, whatever you want to call it. Alright, next I want to take the Sally Girl eyeshadow in Cranberry. And I'm just going to take my fluffy brush. It's by Revlon. And we're going to put this in your crease. And y'all guys are probably going to be able to hear my son's bass outside vibrating through the walls. I'm going to take this is the color icon palette and it's in silent treatment. We're going to take this middle color right here same brush just wipe it off just a little bit pick up a little bit of that and just go ahead and put that in the crease as well. Gonna try not to blend it like all the way over, just keeping it to like the first half. And you know, I usually have music going. But I didn't feel like music today. I'm definitely not left handed either. It's just like red color right here. Same brush again. Just drab a little bit. 
and we're going to just put that right on top of those two colors. I'm going to take a little bit more of that cranberry, wipe off my brush just a tad because it's getting a little dark. And we're just going to try to pop this right over it. Because I don't like the way the eye color looks, the lid part, we're going to see if we can't doctor that up a little bit. What is this one? The sweet, wet and wild, sweetest, sweetest candy. I'm gonna use this middle color right here. Just pop that on the eyelid. All right, now for my brow bone. I'm probably going to be using Mac, um, Mac, ha, <laughs> Maybelline's Champagne Fizz. This is what that looks like. Got to get it. And this brush is just one of those nappy little brushes. I say nappy because I really don't use this brush, but it came from one of those little, like, all together, like, brush kits that you get for at Christmas time. When somebody knows you like makeup but doesn't really know anything about makeup. And we're just going to pop that right underneath the brow bone and blend that down just a tad. Okay, this color like matches me almost perfectly. And it is so hot right now. It's freaking the middle of December. It's December 15th. I live in Florida and it's like. 80 degrees outside. I really wish I was up north in the freaking cold and the snow and then I'd probably bitch about that but the silent treatment palette and we're going to use this top color right there for the brow bone. Okay for our mascara Hmm, do I have a... We're going to use Hard Candy, Curl Up and Die. I've never even opened this yet. I guess I really am not meant to ever wear mascara. I'm going to take my Ulta Glitter Eyeliner. We're just going to go close to the lash line as we can. You guys probably can't see me. I'm probably out of frame. I got to ask, does anybody have like an extra row of eyelashes? Because I have my eyelashes here. And then I have eyelashes that grow like right in here. And it's not very many of them. It's just enough to annoy me that I have to like pluck them out. And that hurts like hell. Now I'm going to take my eyeliner. Gail Hip Eyeliner. And it's just in black. And I'm going to line my waterline. My eyes like are so sensitive. I don't think I've made a video in a while that I've not come out with my eyeballs being red at the end. I just, I don't get it. Ugh, it's a horrible feeling. For blush, I'm going to use this Prestige Fresh Glow Baked Mineral Blush in pink. And I'm going to smile, put it on my apples, and blend it. it open? Yeah. No. Yes. This is another Prestige. It's rich bronze. I'm going to grab a little of my brush, 
smile, well, kind of like, just a little bit, mm -hmm. and just get that hollow of the cheek and bring it up. For my lip color, I'm going to use, this number 918D, like a cherry red, like chocolate covered cherry red. And then just to add a little something something, I'm going to take my little Sally Girl Baked Eyeshadow again, another little synthetic brush, pop some on that little brush, and then just add a little to your lip. like right in the middle and then like right in the point of your cupid's bow and that ladies is my finished look Hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I haven't done one in a really long time. I'm going to actually probably do a rant video next. Now that my makeup's all done, I can do a rant video. So, thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. And I just want to say happy holidays to everyone, whether that be Merry Christmas, you know, Happy Yule, whatever that is. So I just want to say thanks for watching. Thanks for being a subscriber. If you're not, hit the subscribe button. And I will talk to you guys soon. Thanks. Bye.